whoever's in this house, have you been here for over a hundred years? If you've been here a long time, set that music box off. No freaking way. There, Sean, with you. What? Loud thump back here with you. Hello? Can you hit something for me? Oh my god, it, oh man, it's up on it's crawling on you. Oh! Hey. Okay. Thank you. You don't like me being in here? Oh, Josh is nuts. Get in here. Okay, hold on, wait. Hurry the up. Holy. Can you reach up and touch Josh's hand? Oh! 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 Right now we are at Billy Creek Village, getting ready to start our investigation. There's 30 different buildings on the property. Naturally, we're not gonna be able to investigate all of them tonight. So we're gonna focus on the hot spots, which is the general store. We've got a camera and alarms in there right now. The Catholic church, the old school house, mayor's house, and then the civil war house, which is on the other end of the property. We're gonna start down at the church right now. At some point tonight, we're gonna split up and we'll all take different buildings. That way we can hit as many buildings as we can tonight. People hear kids laughing, crying, screaming outside on the property itself. So as we're walking from building to building, we'll just listen for some of that stuff. It's a very, very cold night tonight. It's what, 20 some degrees. The fog's starting to roll into it. So it's a very creepy setting. I really just walked around this place is freaking creepy. Where do you want to start? The schoolhouse? Well, let's go to that church. Let's make our way around. Okay. Okay, so we're getting ready to head into building number one, which is the old Catholic church. I think this building was built like in 1865, and it has served as a church for like 85 years. All these buildings were brought to this property, historical buildings from different parts of the county and they were all brought here. When they set this church in place, it's actually facing the exact same way it was facing when it was in town. Now the one thing that they did say, like when they're running spirit box sessions and stuff in here, they'll get responses back in Latin. That was a male voice. That's kind of what I heard outside. Hello? My name is Josh. These are my brothers, Rocky and Sean. We came here tonight to talk to you. That was that male voice again. Walking. I can't get there ain't there. really nothing back there. Are two chairs. Who is in here with us? Okay, I put a device in here. If you're in here with us, you can walk up and set that off for us. We go to a Catholic place to get our holy water. Sometimes the bishop prays over us. Did you go to church here? Whoa. That was loud. Dude, that was right over here by Jesus. Yeah. Did you show me that alarm over here? Yes. Okay, I've got an alarm over here by Jesus' statue. If you walk up to it, That'll help validate that somebody is in here with us. Oh. 
Thank you. Were you a bishop here at the church? Were you a priest? I keep hearing knocking. Yeah, I heard it too. We came here tonight to talk to you. Tell me you just heard that. Who do we keep hearing? What the heck was that? That is so crazy you keep hearing that. Uh... Oh. Oh. As soon as you talk about Latin. I said Latin and the alarm's going off. We don't know any Latin. Can you speak to us in Latin? Oh, it's back. That's twice now I've mentioned Latin and the alarms went off. Can you talk to us in Latin? Did you work at this church? Oh, something just touched my neck. Did you just touch me? If that was you, can you walk up to the alarm? Can you make it go off and let me know where you're at? Is it okay with what we're doing in here? Whoa! That's how I did it was in here, didn't it? Mm hmm Can you come up here? Sound like it was back there. John, go by that door. The back door? The front door. And just open the door and just stand there and see if you hear. I swear it sounds like somebody's like outside screaming or something. Hello? My name's Sean. I'm not hearing no voices out here. Something back here. Mm -hmm. Who's back here? We keep hearing you. We just want to talk to you. We want to learn more about your church. Learn more about this village. Where are you at right now? It says do not enter. What do you think that means? Look back here is where there was a lot of, uh, there's a lot of stuff back here. Yeah, that's how that room is. But back in here, it sounded like a lot of the knocking and stuff was coming from. Is that one of the prayer things right behind you? Did you hear that? Yeah. Who keeps knocking in here? Why are we not allowed in this room? Whoa. Everybody all here. We know that they probably came up here to do communion. Do you guys believe in ghosts? We know that the Catholic Church does a lot with spirits and ghosts. Demonic entities. Oh, heck with that. I don't know what that was. I know. Watch yourself. I'm saying like over here by myself. We can hear you knocking on stuff. I know, I'm all standing by this door. Tell me you're hearing that. That is freaking crazy. Holy mackinoli. We're gonna get ready to move to the next building. Do you want to say anything before we leave? You hear like a creepy like wind. Yeah, but do you hear the, it's like, like hearing two people talking. A 
I feel like there should be a step right there. Whoa. That was freaking weight. Go, go. Who was that? No, something's back here behind me. Something's back here behind me. Okay, let's go to the schoolhouse. That was freaking creepy in there. Oh, this door's open. What building is this? We shut this door earlier. Yeah, this building is freaking creepy. You know what this place reminds me of? Remember that show, Evil Dead, where they go into that cabin and that girl gets possessed and they lock her in the cellar. She's like a demon. Yeah. This is one of the oldest buildings on the property. If anybody's in here with us, we're just here to talk to you tonight. We are thinking about moving into your cabin. Would you like it if we moved in here with you? That was right above us. There's an upstairs? Yeah. Sean, get up there. Coming up. Josh, I don't even fit. Hello? Is anybody up here? I'm not going to fall through the floor right here, though. Oh, you're not going to fall that far if you do. We just heard, heard you up here. Was this your bedroom? Was you just over there beside Josh? I got a alarm downstairs. If you walk by, it's got a light on it. Just hear that. <laughs> Your place is beautiful. Did anybody live here with you? Let's head back downstairs. It's pretty quiet up here. Yeah. Can you imagine walking up and down these every day? Oh. That'd be hard with a backpack on. Thank you for letting us in your home. So that'd be bad if we was locked in here. It kind of seemed like when we was filming this property, or I mean walking around this property and looking at it and then filming the drone that you kept getting drawn to that church. Because mm -hmm. that was like the one place you wanted to make sure you shown us. Okay, so right now we're gonna make our way over to the uh, schoolhouse, which is another building that they say is pretty active here. Not a whole lot of investigating going on here. So we're going off of what some of the teams has been here already, kind of the hot spot. It's like this is a location you would wanna do in the summertime. Yeah. We're a little crazy. Okay, so right now we're in the schoolhouse. This is another building that a lot of teams that's investigated here have documented activity. Did you go to school here? It's back here. What is your name? We did really bad in school. Were you a good student? I read alarm up here on the teacher's desk. Can you walk up here and set the alarm off? Was your teacher nice to you? Who do we hear? That was loud. Yeah, what the? Where was? Where'd that come from? Back there, behind you? I see a shadow. 
Did we just see you? He looks creepy is when you look out the school windows there. Just imagine. Yeah. Who is the kid that we heard? Can you move one of these desks? Sean, in that small zipper in the very front, there's an SP7. Can you grab that? Hey, I'm sitting at one of your desks. What is your name? Is your name Seth? Seth, did you go to school here? Why are you still here? Last place I'd want to be when I die is stuck in a school. Did you enjoy school? Seth, I've got an alarm up there on the desk. Can you walk up there and set that alarm off for me? Seth, are you walking in here? That went straight down the freaking room. Yeah. It's not like it's down in the chair. It's not like it was over by you, though. Seth, did you sit down in the chair with us? Seth, we thought we heard you sit down at one of the desks. Why don't you come sit next to me? I'm going to turn this device back on so you can talk to me, okay? This device allows us to communicate with you. So if you try as hard as you can to talk to us, we would really appreciate that. Seth, can you say hi? Where are you at right now? School. Yep. Did you hear that? That's where we're at, Seth. Can you come up here and set my alarm off? I promise it won't hurt you. Seth, we can hear you knocking. I want you to see if you can do something else for me. Can you move something or come up and set my alarm off? Can you tutor, Sean? Right before that happened, Rocky, I swear on that, I heard yes. Then right behind you. Let's go do that house and then we'll separate. I think if anything's gonna be like crazy haunted, it's gonna be one of the two houses. But that church and that school, we did get stuff. Yeah. I mean, it proves that something, there is stuff here. What the f Oh, oh my God, do you hear that? That door handle moved. Hello? Heard a thump right before you moved, Josh. We came here to talk to the governor. We want to get our taxes lowered. I'm getting a pretty baseline reading in here. 
Governor, can you come out and talk to us, please? I'm getting high EMF in this room. We know there's no power in here. Can you see us? If there's anybody in here with us, we've got some devices. Oh, high EMF. Can you set one of our devices off? Oh! Whoa! Oh! Loud thump back there, Sean, with you. What? Loud thump back here with you. Hello? Oh! Whoa! Oh! Loud thump back there, Sean, with you. What? Loud thump back here with you. Hello? Who was that? Super high EMF, look. Holy crap, my freaking heart. The alarm went off and a huge thump. Are you not happy that we're inside your house? Yeah, that was a freaking loud banging back here. back here behind me. Where, whoa, there, it started to, went up a little. Let's go out here. I think we need to find where it's spiking, like you said. Whoa, there, spike. It's like I'll walk through it, and then it goes away. You want me to follow you? Are you trying to lead us somewhere? I swear I heard something, another bang back there. If that was you, could you just hit something really hard for us, please? Did you hear that? Josh, I'll sit here while you're in there. Okay, you've set our alarm off in here a few times. Can you walk back over there and set it off for me, please? We have some issues with the state of Indiana. We spend way too much time in Indiana. So, Governor, we want you to come out and talk to us. Sean, you know what we should do? Is we'll, um... Get those walkie talkies. We'll set up the house over there. Just from doing the walkthrough during the day, I think that house back there, the Civil War house, to me has like, felt like it had the most energy, a dark energy. And we know it's got paranormal activity dating back over a hundred years ago. So if we set up GoPros and alarms inside that house and then send you in by yourself. Sean, what if you go into the house, me and Rocky will go get coffee. Uh-uh. No. You, you go in the house, me and Rocky are in the house. 
Okay, so right now we're getting ready to head over to the Civil War house. We're gonna send Sean in alone. From all the places that we did our walk through today, it's got like the creepiest vibe to it. It's got paranormal activity that dates back hundreds of years. The first time we walked into that house, this one I'm nervous about going in. And I haven't been nervous in a while. This one, I am totally, totally nervous, but I'll do it. I'm in here by myself, which this place here, out of all these places that we've been into tonight here on this property, makes you feel a lot different. I mean, it's a total different feeling. To me, it, I'd hate to say it, but it feels like a darker feeling. Pretty terrifying to be in here by myself, but I got a walkie talkie, so I just confirmed with Josh that we can hear each other, so we'll uh, go ahead and get this started. I'm afraid to even ask a question. I mean, you gotta remember this house back in the 1800s, two older women that lived in this house had people come in and investigate, but we don't know why. What was happening to them, we're gonna see if this many years later, hundreds of years later, if it's still here. Hello? My name's Sean. I have alarms set up in this house. If you'd like to communicate with me, you can walk up to them and they'll go off. They'll let me know that you're the, where you're at. I just heard walking. Can you walk up to one of my alarms? I just heard you. Okay, from in there, so I guess let's venture in here. Oh my God, it's so freaking dark. Like going in room to room or anything, it feels like I'm on a nail in my head. Many, many years ago, that this place was investigated. Can you tell me why? Moaning. Holy. It is so freaking dark. Yeah, I got a lot of cameras. Okay, I got alarm right there. Can you set that off for me? Let me know what room you're in. I've heard you twice now. Can you move one of these rocking chairs? Do you want to talk to me? The two older women that lived in this house, are you still here? I'll tell you what, this room that I'm about to go in. This is a room I really do not like. Clothes in here. Oh! Jesus! Okay. Thank you. Do you not like me being in here? Holy Oh! I knew this working bedroom. Man, I don't know. There's an upstairs to this place and I seriously do not think I can do it. Is it the old women that are in here? I wish I knew your name. 
Do you like that music box? My body is freaking shaking right now. Footsteps behind me. Do you not like me being in this room? Like I just seen something in front of me over by the music box. Can you please set that off for me again? Do you like scaring me? Walking. Can you come back in here? I got another alarm out there. Can you set that off? Holy shit, there's something out there. There's some freaking walking. Yeah, I don't know how long I can do this. This is nuts. I tell you, there, it feels like a dark presence in this house. I got a device that you may be able to talk through if you like. Would you like me to turn that on? You may not be used to this kind of uh, technology that we're using. Is that why you keep checking out the music box? I'm afraid to freaking turn on the ghost too. It's a gunshot. I'm telling you, I'm out here by my fucking self. I have no clue where Josh and Rocky are. Another gunshot. Oh, it's back. Did you hear the gunshot too? Josh, I keep hearing gunshots. Are you in here now? Am I safe? What? Hey, oh my. Okay, calm down. Okay, I'm out. Okay? Josh, this music box is going nuts. Get in here. Okay, we're awake. Holy. Hurry the up. Holy Yeah, I can't. I seriously can't do this. I'm telling you, I feel like it's so fucking dark in this place. Maybe it's me, I don't know, but I can't even freaking move. I don't even know which way to freaking go. Yeah, I can't. There ain't no fucking way. Dude, I'm telling you, that box, I went in there and I think, as soon as I went in that room and started talking, I think started going nuts. Then, listen. Dude, I feel like I'm like paralyzed. I mean, I'm so scared I can't move. That freaking music box, after I said something, talked to you or whatever, and talked about the gunshots, then that went off. Then, next thing I know, that thing went ballistic. I mean, went nuts. I'm serious, you should go back and Hello? If you're still in the bedroom, can you set the music box off again? Come on, you did it earlier. You know you were scaring me. Did you ever make it out of this room? I was in here. I know you don't like me being in this room. Because I was thinking about Gary Walk. I was going to come back in here. And then that thing went 
ballistic when I'm standing right there where you are, Rocky. I mean, it went freaking nuts. So, is it the two older women? I was hearing footsteps. I heard, I couldn't make out the voice whether it was like woman male. I'm still shaking. Okay, so right now I'm inside the house by myself. Rocky and Sean's leaving. Whatever was in here scared Sean, so he doesn't want to stay in here anymore. I knew it doing the walkthrough today. Like anybody that goes into like a haunted place or people that's been investigating for a long time, you know when you walk into a place and it just feels uneasy and creepy. And that's exactly how this house feels. And this house has got like... <gasps> Hello? My name is Josh. Who is in this house with me? Whoa! I know this house has a history of the paranormal. The two ladies that used to live here back in the 1800s thought this house was haunted. You guys brought in a ghost hunter. I'm a ghost hunter from Ohio. We get into this house and everything's going freaking crazy. I want to walk over by the bed, but I'm afraid. This house is huge. It's got an upstairs too. Whoever's in this house, have you been here for over a hundred years? If you've been here a long time, set that music box off. No freaking way. Thank you. What is your name? Are you one of the old ladies? Can you hit something for me? You want me to leave this room? Was this your bedroom? Okay, I'm gonna sit here in this creepy ass rocking chair. I'm out of that room now. Dude, I have no f***ing lights. I'm afraid to walk around this house. Upstairs walking. Are you upstairs? Upstairs is like crazy creepy. I don't know if I got the balls to walk upstairs. I know if I don't walk upstairs, I'm going to regret it because I didn't do it. I know if I walk upstairs, I'm going to regret it because I did do it. Okay, let's do this. Like if you guys get the chance to come to any place that's freaking crazy. Billy Creek Village. Come to the Civil War house. Maybe the hauntedest place we've been to this year. Okay, I'm gonna go upstairs. Oh God. Okay, how many of you guys would actually walk up there right now? I'm coming upstairs. Here we go. OK, 
camera forward, one camera behind me. Okay. How about we just stay over by the stairs? It is so freaking cold up here. I legit can't see anything up here. It's so freaking dark. I'll show you guys how dark this room is. Oh, something just flew by. Was that you? That's all I see. That's how dark this place is. Did you just fly in front of my camera? Kid, there's some toys and stuff over there. Can you hit something or move something? <gasps> no way. Thank you. I want to walk back there, but I'm afraid. Is it safe to walk back there? Okay, I've got a rocking chair here. If there's any children up here, can you move my rocking chair for me? Where are you at? I'm going to push back into this bedroom. I've got a camera on that rocking chair right there. Hello? My name is Josh. I know you had ghost hunters in here 100 years ago because you believe that this house was haunted. No way. Is that ghost still in this house? Can you come out and show yourself? Hey, Sean. I'm upstairs right now and it is so freaking creepy. That's what Rocky was just talking about downstairs. Uh, he felt like he was the creepiest. Something's walking. If there's anything or anyone inside this house, I want you to come forward let me see you or hear you. Were you scared of the two old ladies that lived in this house? I've got a rocking chair right here. I'm going to go back downstairs. I'm going to leave one of my cameras up here. Yeah, this upstairs has definitely got a creepy feeling to it. Hi, my name's Rocky.
Can you tell me your name? Mr. House? Say Rocky if you're up here. Hi, right, what's your name? Okay, so right now Rocky's in the house and he's basically having the same experience as Sean and I did. The only difference is when Sean was in there, he was hearing gunshots. And we were talking about that is this is a Civil War house. So if there were gunshots out here, my window is down. We would have heard them. I was just so cold up here. You might be cold. What are you using up here? Is that because you barred me? No. Yeah. Yeah, I feel you on my back. You die in this house? Are you a one by two women that used to live here? Uh, I look down. It looks like this white mist is shot across the room. Is that you? Are you saying? Who keeps setting off the music box? There are three of us. Two of us are outside, and one is inside the house by himself. We know that this house has a history of being haunted. Who is the spirit that was in here that the two older women seen? I hear you. Oh my gosh. Where are you at? Who is messing with Sean? Who's me? What's your name? Why were you messing with Sean? Hello. Hello. Who are you? Can you go touch Rocky? No thanks. No thanks. You can touch Rocky. He likes to be touched. He likes getting hugs, especially from older women. Is there anything you want to say to me? Devil. Tony, I feel like something dark in that house. Let me know how strong you are. Can you see what? Sean. Holy no. Take a phone. I want you to scare Rocky so he comes out of that house. Be careful. Holy. Sean, be careful. Why does Sean need to be careful? Probably because I was sitting there holding a cross. All right, we're coming in. Keep that running. Should I wear the cross in there? Yeah. That was crazy in here. Okay, we're coming. I was asking for you. Holy. The music box was going freaking absolutely nuts. The... SP7 added on the bed, the post. It looked like something shot and, up from that. And it would change the light from like red to blue. And then it just went crazy. It would not stop. I told you this room was nuts. And then, uh, then it, was, it sounded like someone was talking through it. Blue. Rim pot off. Blue throat. And you just said that turned out blue. Are you from here? Olivia. Olivia. See you later. Bye, Olivia. Bye, Ed. You stay here. Yep, you're not allowed to go with us. Okay, so right now, Rocky's down at the 
Catholic Church running the session. Sean and I are going to do a sweep with the SLS camera on the outside of the property. It has gotten very cold out. It is 20, what, 24, 26 yeah. degrees. So it is freezing cold out right now. But they have a lot of things that they hear children screaming, crying, laughing, running around. So we're gonna do a sweep with the SLS camera and see if we can document anything. We got a device here that could probably see you. Could you make yourself known? We should do. What's that? We should be the first paranormal team to get goats on the SLS camera. Let's do it. Okay. We can get duck too. Picking them up. It did. I think it's just moving so much. Hey, Billy. Billy. Can you see him? Loud bang inside the house. So I went to the door. I cracked it open the door. I was like, Josh. Josh. Nothing. I was like, I was like, heck with this. Heard it shut the door, and I turned around, and then I seen you guys over here, and I was like, yeah, this ain't too good. Let's go. You know what? We're the first paranormal team to get goats on the SLS camera. <laughs> it was a Brock. Brock, you said he heard something loud in here. Who was that, Governor? Can you make that loud noise again? We're gonna be leaving shortly. If somebody's in this house, can you walk up to Josh? I go, can you set the kitchen table? And a little kid goes, table! That was nuts. I mean, plain as day. Who just said that? Can you go set the kitchen table? Can you talk to me again? Oh man, that was freaking plain as day too. It's one of these audios had to catch it. I mean, I never seen that thing was buzzing, but maybe the GoPro. Mm -hmm. Hopefully the GoPro caught it. Hey, I got... Where'd it go? There was something over there in that chair. Oh, it's on the floor. Or no, that's the piano. Are you the one that was just talking to me? Look how small it is. And it's gone. Come back, please. I like talking to you. It's back. Can you please say something to me again? Can you say Sean? Josh gonna walk over to you, okay? Yep, right away. Okay, yeah, just stand there for a second. Can you come back? Josh came back. Oh man, it's up on you, it's crawling on you! Holy cow. It's, dude, it just went away. Oh my god, it's you and it. It's sitting right beside you again. Holy fuck. Yeah, it crawled on you, now it's back down. Are you the child that Sean heard? Its head's like heading over your leg. Can you touch me? I just did. Put your hand out, Josh. Can you reach up and touch Josh's hand? Oh! 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 
Let's go. What the f Who was that? Don't mess with the kid, I guess. All the chairs are in the same spot. Cabinet doors are open. Were those open earlier? Uh, yeah. Who did we just hear? Let's go. What the? F oh, my batteries went dead. That is crazy. Both batteries go dead at the same time. Who did we hear in here? Yeah, that was bad. That was about freaking jumped in Josh's arms. Was that a child or was that the governor? Don't leave me the f in here. Now. Okay, I'm in the house by myself. I want to hear that loud bang again, please. This right here is the spot that we've seen you. Who are you? Do you like having people inside your house? Do you want me to leave? Do something and I'll leave. I heard you. I'm in here by myself. What are you going to do? I hear you walking. Are you getting closer to me? Okay, this room is freaking cold. We're going to get ready to leave. Do you want to say anything before we go? This house is like legit so quiet so you hear every little freaking noise. Seth, are you the kid from the school? They say that they see kids running all over this place. They hear kids. Okay, I'm going to leave. Okay, my heart can only take so much.